I work with people fairly frequently helping them to prepare for interview. It's probably three or four clients a week. And virtually every client I work with, we're dealing with the issue of mindset when it comes to interviews. You know, the way we're so tough on ourselves or we get in our own ways. And it's often as well looking at managing what would be excessive nervousness. Now, this is a topic that's fairly vast, but over the last uh, few months, uh, I've, I've found, I've discovered when working with people that a lot of that nervousness is based on common misconceptions around interviews. And I just want to speak about those a little in this short video. The first misconception we run is that I have to tell them, the interviewers, what I think it is that they need to hear. And out of that common misconception comes the thinking of that there are right and wrong answers with interviews. When there isn't really, there's only your answer. Because every question at an interview is based on your experiences and your opinions, two areas that you're expert in. The second uh, pitfall or the second trap that we fall into when we're preparing for interview and that really inhibits us is that we're running the limiting belief that they will be judging me negatively. Now we do know the role of interviewers is to assess you, but as humans we don't work that word assessment, we work it as judgment and we're leaning into negative judgment most of the time. But here's the insight on that one, if you're running the pattern that they will be judging me negatively, you're actually the one who's judging them negatively, like you're judging the interviewers negatively because they're neutral, they're there just to find out more about you. And at the same time we're also judging ourselves negatively, which is you know getting in our own way. So hopefully those few little tips are of benefit to you. More information is available on my website, jamesweekman.com.